Hi Aries, welcome to Angel Love 333. Hope everybody is doing well. A couple things here before we start. This is your reading uh, messages from Spirit and the Angels. It can be about any area in your life. It's not specific to love, but it can be if it resonates for you. Everything else uh, in the description box uh, that you need to know about my channel is there. You can follow me on TikTok and Instagram uh, addresses below, okay? So with that, let's get started with your reading, Aries. Also, I want to say thank you for all of your likes, your shares, subscribing to my channel. I do appreciate you. All right, looks like uh, we already got your two messages. Okay, so uh, let me pull the rest of your cards here. I did that, made a mistake in the last reading as I started reading them before I pulled the cards. So if you've watched this reading before, the card I just pulled um, is from, from the Archangel Power Tarot deck. We're pulling your energy center. We're gonna now pull the energy around you. What's the energy here for Aries? Please show Aries what they need to know. And next, we're going to pull uh, some angel answer cards. You can ask a question. There is yes and no. If yes or no doesn't come out, then uh, just take uh, the angel guidance. That's what they want you to know. Uh, it may not have an answer yet. Okay, it can be that as well. Okay, and then the last message um, is postcards from spirit. This is a very detailed and insightful message from Spirit and your ancestors. Uh, I recommend uh, you know listening to this message. I get a lot of great feedback. So there it is. Okay. So Aries, let's get started here. Okay. So your first call card is the Goddess of White Terra, and uh, it's sensitivity. You are becoming increasingly sensitive. Avoid harsh relationships, environments, situations, and elements, okay? So that, that can be a lot of different things, right? You, you could be, um, I'll say, I don't know why I'm hearing the word subjected, subjected to different types of energy. People around you, situations um, can drain our energy, right? And affect us. Even, you know, certain shows, uh, you know, TV we watch, all those different things affect our energy. So they're saying here, stay away from the harsh energy, okay? Um, because right now you could be more sensitive than normal, <clears throat> excuse me. And um, so those things may affect you more than maybe they normally do, okay? You have here, sorry about that, Aries, I had to uh, clear my throat. Okay, so constantly battling uh, allergies here. But you have the goddess of Athena. It's inner wisdom. You know what to do. Trust your inner wisdom and take appropriate action without delay. Okay, so there may be something here. I'm going to say here, maybe you're dealing with a situation that um, is not good for you, right? And they're saying here you have the wisdom, right, to make an informed decision about your situation. So it may just be about maybe like I, I told you, I heard the word subjected. Maybe you're subjecting yourself to something that really isn't good for you. Um, you, you know, it can be anything. It can be, you know, something, a temptation. It can be a person, right? Um, it could be, you know, maybe you're going to bars at night and you need to get rest. I don't know what it is. Okay. It could be all different things here, but there's something here I feel that um, is not healthy for you. And, you know, it could even be about your diet, right? But you, you know, right? This is saying you have that wisdom. So let's see what uh, your tarot has to say here. Okay. Interesting. Okay, this could be it right here, the Nine of Michael. Uh, your worry is unnecessary. Focus your thoughts on the outcome you desire. Release feelings of regret, guilt, or worry to your angels. Okay, it could be that, Aries. It could be, 
you know, you're overthinking something, it could be worry, stress, something here on your mind that has you worried, okay? And that, that could in itself, now it could be the situation here that you're dealing with, like I said, something unhealthy that you're dealing with or causes worry or stress, right? Uh, but that's in the center of your energy. Now, um, in your foundation, you have the Four of Pentacles. So some of you could be stressed around money, some of you, um, I'm going to say maybe um, you could be overspending, right? That could be, um, you know, harsh on you, okay? Some of you, it's a situation where you're feeling uh, maybe there's lack of effort on somebody's part. I'm getting that energy. We're going to clarify some of these cards, okay? You have here the Knight of Pentacles. So it feels like whatever situation you're dealing with, it feels like it's at a standstill, right? It feels like it, it's a time where you may be right taking some time to yourself to think about things. Now, I was going to say it here with the sensitivity card uh, I was going to say here meditation may help to clear your thoughts clear your energy um, and this is a card here that of meditation right taking some time to yourself to gain some clarity here okay so I feel like that's guidance there and then you also have here the four of cups so you know with all of this energy here I definitely feel there's something here that you're not feeling good about you're not feeling content about it and I feel like spirit and your angels are telling you that you know what to do. You know what action you need to take. But I feel like there's some sort of worry around it. So let's clarify some of these cards and let's see what that is about. Now, this can be some sort of offer being pr presented to you. I'm going to say that as well. Um, because that could be what's stressing you out, right? Or the worry here. Let's see why the nine of, Pen nine of Michael is here, okay? Now, if you're dealing with a particular person, I'm going to say roles and energies can be reversed as well, okay? So why is the Nine of Michael here? What's this worry about? Okay, Page of Cups. Lovers, okay. Lowa we'll put love in the situation here. Wow, and the Ten of Pentacles, interesting. And the King of Swords, okay? So I feel um, Aries, okay? You have said there's, there's some sort of worry here, right? Regret about something. Clarifying that you have the Page of Cups, the Lovers, and you have the Ten of Pentacles. Definitely, I feel for a lot of you, this is someone that's very close to your heart. Um, somebody here that uh, I feel, it feels like it's an energy here where you want to hear from this person. It could be from a child. doesn't necessarily have to be a love situation. you got strong Gemini energy there. So I feel there's some sort of worry around a child or a, a love relationship here or somebody younger than you, okay? It's around stability too. So it can be around finances. It can be around a relationship here. Uh, also can be, uh, yeah, look at that. Uh, Five of Pentacles and the King of Swords. So there may be lack of communication between you and somebody here. And that's the worry here on your mind. Let's clarify since we know that there's a lack of communication or maybe it's lack of effort here by somebody. But let's see, why is the Five of Pentacles here, please? Why is the Five of Pentacles here? Okay, Five of Swords, Death card, Star card, let's get one more. Three of Wands, okay, King of Swords is still on the bottom of the deck, okay, yeah. It feels like there was some sort of fight or conflict, could be with a Scorpio. Um, so I feel like there was some sort of ending here or argument between you and someone. Okay, like I said, it feels like a younger energy uh, they don't have to be young. They could just, you know, have a very uh, young personality or look to them. But this person here, like I said, it could be a child. Um, but I'm also getting very strongly a love situation. Okay. Uh, you have the star card and the three of wands. Okay. So I feel like there's been lack of communication here between you and somebody and I feel the lack of movement here in the situation is really what's causing the worry. I'm also getting here too, right? 
uh, whatever happened between you and this person, you're not feeling real content about the situation. And that could be here, you know, maybe you're subjecting yourself to something that maybe wasn't healthy. Um, but let's see what that Four of Cups is. Or why, why is the Four of Cups here, please? Why is the Four of Cups here, please? Okay, you have the Nine of Cups. You have the High Priestess. You have the Temperance card. King of Swords. Interesting. And the Tower. Okay. I feel Aries, um, you got strong Pisces, you have strong Cancerian energy. I feel like you, I, I don't know, I just got, um, I feel like you got somebody here reaching out to you. I see communication here with this King of Swords, okay? I feel that you're not feeling good or content about the situation. I feel that um, this may be somebody here um, who may have been secretive from you or there may be some sort of truth here that this person um, needs to be honest or, or something that they need to communicate to you. I'm going to say uh, for some of you because of the energy that we were getting here in the beginning you could be dealing with somebody maybe who uh maybe drinks a lot or you found out this person drank drank a lot i don't know i get that or they party or they're secretive about going out or, or something like that okay but what i do see here you have the temperance and you have the king of swords so i feel what's going to happen is uh you're going to yeah because the tower's here too there's going to be something here you find out, okay, I feel about this person. Now, whether it's either going to be that this person is going to tell you because they want to reconnect with you, they want to, to heal things here, um, or I feel like there is some sort of truth uh, that is coming out, and it's, and it's going to happen in time. It's going to happen in divine timing here. Could be uh, dealing with a Sagittarius. But I feel whatever you're not feeling content or happy about um, with somebody here, they're coming back around. And I feel like there is going to be communication. And there's some sort of, of something here that either they were hiding or there was some sort of secret here. Yeah, look at that. Page of Swords. They've been very aloof about the situation here. And I feel that this person has probably been, uh, you know, curious about you or, you know, or maybe if you do some investigating, you may find out here, you have the hangman here as well. That's why there's some sort of delay because there's some sort of truth, I feel, uh, Aries, that needs to come out. And either your person here is coming back around or is coming around, whoever this is for you, and they're going to bring that truth to you or I feel like you're going to find out on your own. Okay, and um, let's see what you got here. All right, so your your first card I have here is ask for help from others. Okay, so this may be a situation, especially if there's drinking involved or some sort of addiction or something unhealthy. You may need to ask for help or support, right? You know, there's different avenues, uh, you know take that one how it resonates with you it could be around addiction it could be around therapy or just even asking uh you know advice here from friends or spiritual advice but you have here some, there's something better okay so i feel here what they're saying there's something in the works here there's something better here now it does feel here that you already have the inner wisdom so you may already know uh in your heart right or just by experience of what to do here um, that's why we see you here in the near future uh, taking some time to yourself and gaining clarity okay i feel like your angels are, are saying here there may be something better um, that's in the works that you can't see if it's a love situation i feel like they're saying there may be a better situation than the situation you're dealing with now all right 
Uh, for others, if this is family, friend type of situation, I feel like they're saying here that there is going to be a, re a, a resolution and, and it's going to be better. But you also have here abundance, which is really nice. So this may be a whole separate message, but uh, you're being guided here to say that you got a lot of abundance coming into your life. But you may need to be patient here. Like I said, there may be some things that need to play out you know especially here with the tower some divine intervention here to get things moving okay but i feel that um you, there's definitely some sort of worry here around stability relationships some of you it could be financial so aries i hope that makes sense to you <laughs> just listen to your intuition uh, about it so Here's your message from spirit and your ancestors. Dearest Aries, you have a unique purpose and destiny that only you can fulfill. But first you need to know that destiny isn't a destination. You don't arrive at some special place where poof, you're perfect and happy all the time. It's about establishing and firming up a commitment to a certain experience, whatever form that takes. Your soul knows what you need to experience. Your destiny is to be present to all of life's adventures, to discover your talents and full potential through allowing inspiration to lead you and to risk standing apart from the crowd to listen to your soul. You are special as much as you are also paradoxically one with the world, individual yet part of the great whole. Both truths have led you to this moment where we are saying you are on the right track even if your ego self doesn't see that listen to your soul check in with spirit and keep going spirit loves you life loves you and we love you so really on point energy here i feel for you aries um because it feels to the worry may be around the timing of this right or making some sort of decision but i feel uh, you know the, you know the divine here is going to uh, kind of make things happen but it may take a little bit of time so Aries I hope this reading helped you I hope you all have a wonderful rest of the day or evening and I'm sending you angel love